So for instance, if you take OP squared, we know that it's going to be equal to my two legs, 1 squared plus 1 squared. Right, and then we have OP squared is equal to just 1 plus 1 gives me 2. And then I already get OP by myself. I just need to take the square root of both sides, so we get root 2. So I know now that that side length is root 2. Well, a lot of people put, um, like, let's say, the tan of 45 into their calculator, and they're not really sure why the answer spits out 1. Well, using these exact value triangles, and this is what I said we're going to build on the next unit quite a bit, um, we can determine why you get 1, for instance. Okay? So let's take a look at our three different trigonometric ratios in terms of this. So if you take, uh, let's start with tangent, tangent of 45 degrees. Well, using this exact value triangle, we would see that tangent is equal to my opposite 1, over my hypotenuse 1, which is just equal, sorry, not my hypotenuse, my adjacent 1, which is equal to 1. We have, let's deal with cosine next. Cosine of 45 degrees is equal to my adjacent 1 over my hypotenuse root 2. Okay. And we'll also see that the sine ratio of 45 degrees is equal to 1 over root 2. Right? So these represent the exact value trigonometric ratios for um, this triangle, where we have side lengths that are equal to one unit, and uh, we have a hypotenuse that uh, is root two. All right, this concludes this lesson.